Good afternoon, YouTube. Today we got something a little different going on today. I'm going to show you how to put a door hinge uh, thing that keeps the door from opening up all the way on 379. Uh, today it's it's a little bit of a pain in the butt. So I have got halfway into this door. I still got the stock original on it, and I'll kind of get you adjusted what I've done so far. So here you go. So I had to take the I take the panel apart on the door. Uh, I had one screw over here on the on the uh, door lock itself. All right, take the panel off, take the interior off, and you're sitting over here on the ground in the dark. Now you know how a door works. This here and this here. Okay. So basically, what happened was this whole mechanism be in the door like this all right keeps the door from opening up all the way and bowing the door and all that good stuff so that's what this is for okay so I had to go get a new one it is a door check is what it is it's a door check all right so that's what I had to change the door check on the door uh, right now, I am uh, getting all the bolts and everything on the door as we speak so that I may put the rest of the door together, okay? So, basically, you got bolts behind here. I'll get to shine the light down under there, there on the inside the door here. I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but see that bolt right there? And there's another one up above. Okay, you have to have the you have to get the nuts off in order to get the Phillips screw that is in there. Okay, just for that only. All right. Sometimes they have um, pop rivets in there, and then also I had some screws here. Sometimes they got pop rivets in that too. So you might need a drill to get all this off. Okay. So I'm going to tighten these back up, and then I'll show you the rest of the assembly, all right? So hold on. All right, so I got all this tightened up. Now i got to put these on over here. A little bit of light on here for you guys to see a little. I'm trying to hold a camera and get perfect lighting and dark, it's kind of a pain in the butt, but we'll get it. There we go. So, you gotta put the two deals here. Of course, I've gotta slip this through here and then put all everything in. So, hold on. Alright, so I got the screws in right here. Now, this is a little bit tricky. You have to put this little part in first. Okay? But what I figured out was inside the dash, there's a cubby hole in there. You'll find it. I'm not going to go into great detail. But there's a hole that you can get into here, okay, from inside the dash. So you'll have to take your panel off your dash in order to get to that. Then you just tighten down your screws, put your pin in your door, and you're good, and put the rest of the door back together. That's how you do it. 